Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm gonna to be doing a different video. I'm going to be showing you guys a recipe on a drink that I currently am obsessed with. And I pretty much probably drink this every, every other Fridays, every other Saturdays, sometimes a Thursday if I really need to relax. And I always only make about one or two, so I'm not making a fool out of myself. I'm not that type of person. I'm very much a casual drinker. I'm not the type of person that likes to get drunk. So I just like things to relax me and just, you know, you're a mom, you need to relax for a little bit. Kids have been driving you nuts all day, all week long. You need to chill out, but this drink, you guys may have seen it on my Snapchat or Instagram. And this is actually a highly requested video off of Snapchat. A lot of you guys will Snapchat me back asking if I can do a recipe video on it. So I'm here today to do that for you guys. Everyone that is asking me for it, this video is for you. So the drink is called a mojito. You may know how to make it. If you do, leave me some tips down below on what you kind of do for your mojito. Um, but this is just... The, how I do it. So if you guys want to know how I do it, it's very refreshing. It's something that's sweet but not sweet. I mean, I'm not saying it's the healthiest drink in the world because it's not healthy at all. So um, yeah, I'm just going to show you guys how I make it and hopefully you guys make it and it comes out really good for you. Um, but yeah, I'm going to get right into this video. So a main ingredient for this drink is mint. You're going to need about two to three mint leaves so i got this mint plant at walmart I actually had to get a new one because my other one completely died so i just went and got a new one and um yeah it last my last one lasted me for about a good month so hopefully this one lasts me for a month as well um but yeah so you definitely need um two to three mint leaves another uh main ingredient you're going to need is rum um, it's not like the most expensive rum out there, but it's because I love this drink and it's something that I like to have on my weekends. Um, so I am running out, but I do have another bottle. Um, I'm just going to show you this one. I get it at Walmart for about $5.98 and I find it really good. It's not um, brown rum either. It's a white brown, uh, rum, so I don't recommend getting a brown one. I would use a white rum. You're also going to need one lime. Um, you can use a half a lime, but I recommend using a full lime or, nah, I recommend using a full lime. So yeah, you can use a half, trust me. You can use a half, cause I have done it, but it tastes a lot better when you have a full lime. And you're going to need two tablespoons of sugar. So I'm using white sugar, or you can use like um, sweetener, just anything that makes it sweet. Uh, but I'm going to be using uh, white sugar and I'm using two tablespoons of it. And then of course you're going to need like a tall glass. But I find that my mojitos taste a lot better in a glass than like a regular cup. So here is my glass. How could I forget an ingredient? You're going to need club soda. So normally I get the club soda from Walmart, but a friend of mine recommended at Winco. They have this huge bottle for only... 89 cents and it's a huge um, club soda bottle and the ones at Walmart are like this small compared to this and it's not even this wide so it's it's huge it's a two liter so uh, it tastes just as good as the regular club soda that you would buy in the little tiny bottle and yeah so it comes with a lot more and it's a lot cheaper so that's the club soda I'm using and you're going to use two-thirds uh, two-third cup of club soda for the drink so the first step you're gonna do is put the mints in the cup. I already did it. All I'm doing is meddling it with a spoon and see how it releases the natural oils of the mint. Can you kind of tell like it looks like it's wet and glossy down there? That is all the oil from the mint. So I'm not gonna like meddle it like, is it mend it or metal? I don't know, but it's one of those. And, um, but I'm not gonna crush it too much because I'm gonna crush it when I put the two tablespoons of sugar. So after you see all the mint oil down there and you smell it, it smells so minty, um, you're going to go ahead and add in the two tablespoons of sugar. And then after you put the sugar in, go ahead and start crushing it. And then just do that until like the sugar looks like it's 
got the oil all in it, looks all clumpy. All right, so that's how it's going to look after you're done, and then you're going to squeeze the whole lime in here. Like, squeeze it real good. Okay, so all the lime I squeezed out of the freaking um, lime. So that's how it looks. I got a lot of lime juice out of it. It was a really like juicy lime. So now you're just gonna mix it real good because can you tell like now it looks like there's no sugar at all. So you're just gonna mix it real good with the spoon. This is two shots in one shot glass. And all you need is one shot of rum for this drink. So I just went ahead and uh, filled the glass cup um, with like half. So it's basically equaling out to one shot. So yeah, you're just basically gonna add one shot of rum. And then mix it really good. So that's how it looks once the rum is added in and mixed. So it kind of looks like you're already getting the cup filling. For my drink, I normally let this all sit for a good minute before I add the ice. So it already sat for a good minute. So now I'm gonna add ice and I'm gonna fill the ice up to about here. So basically you're filling the cup up with ice. So once the ice is filled in the cup, it brings the drink up a lot much more, you see? So now we're gonna add the two-third cup of club soda. So here's my two-third cup of club soda. So I'm gonna carefully fill it up. And that's that. So you see how all the lime juice is at the bottom and then the club soda is right there. So you're just going to grab a straw. I buy these straws at Dollar Tree for a dollar and it comes with like a hundred of them I think. So just going to mix it all together. And there is the mojito. It is so delicious. Like this is probably one of my favorite drinks ever right now. And so that's how the mojito looks and it tastes refreshing. This is a great summer alcohol beverage. So yeah, that's how you make it. Mm, it tastes so delicious. So. This is how you make the mojito. I hope you guys got a good recipe out of it. Um, if you guys make it, tag me on Instagram or send me a Snapchat of your drink and let me know if it came out good. Um, but anyways, if you guys enjoyed this video, please give it a big thumbs up. Also click the subscribe button for more. If you guys like these kind of videos, like of drinks and stuff like that, let me know. I'll probably make some more if you guys want. Like, I only made it because you guys wanted, not just because I was like, oh, I'm going to show y'all how to make a mojito. But yeah, you guys <laughs> requested this video. But anyways, thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye, everybody.